The other big mistake um, that I've made is waiting too late to start. Um, when I was new in my career, I think it was just two, I was one year in, and uh, the receptionist calls me and says that there's a young man here uh, from the university who needs to see someone he wants to start to invest. And I said, yeah, sure, I have, let him come. So he comes in, we sit together, and uh, he, was, he, he was joking the other day. He said he came in slippers and a t-shirt, which is true, but I didn't even think about that. And we sat down and he shared with me such an amazing story. He shared how his mom had passed away the year before. Um, he didn't have a dad, he was an orphan, and he had three siblings, so were four of them. And he said, look, I have just received money from help, and I'm so excited that I've received money from help, and I want to be able to invest this money so that I can grow, because I don't have an uncle or an auntie or anybody who's going to help me. And so I listened to him, and he said, can you work with me to help me figure out where to invest my money? And so we, I said, sure, and we started to work together. He had brought 19,000. I mean, I'm sorry, he had brought 5,000, and 19,000 he was going to use for the rest of the term. Anyway, the point is that he began. Sometimes he'd bring 3,000, sometimes it'd be 2,000, sometimes it'd be nothing. And it wasn't every month, but it was every time he could bring something. And eventually he finished his education, but continued to bring when he was an, in an intern. And 2011, so that was 2002. I've been in the market for about, it'll be 20 years this uh, May. In 2011, I had now moved departments, I wasn't working with him anymore, and I received a request for an electronic funds transfer for 2.85 million, and it was his name on it. And I was like, how did we get here? And so I called him and I said, look, I, uh, 2.8 million, he had sold his shares and he wanted to um, um, put down a deposit for uh, an office and he was going to be a landlord. And I'm like, from 5,000. Um, and he taught me so many. Sometimes we look at, well, I looked at what I had, and I'm like, it's so little. I might as well just go and have lunch. You know what I mean? Um, but he showed me that with consistency and with dedication and discipline, just whatever it is, even if it's a 1,000 shillings, consistently putting it aside, over time, you actually do very well. Today he's so amazing. He's gone so far in his investment journey because he started at 19. He's almost 40 now. Um, he's been my client for uh, 18 years and it's been completely, completely amazing. This sounds so good. Atomic habits, if you read that, and consistency, you know, just keeping with it and just looking at the multiplayer effect. Yeah.